Assalamualaikum and good morning everyone. Okay, I'm from class DDP S today. Uh, today, I and my team gonna explain about SEO tools in cyber ownership or we call it business. So before that, I will intro myself. My name is Muhammad Shazwan Mujibir and my IG matching number is one zero zero one DDP one nine F one zero five zero. Hello, my name is Muhammad Nabi Najmi bin Hazami and now my number metric is 01DDT19F1005 Alright, uh, my name is Muhammad Hatim bin Badr Azmi and my metric number is 01DDT19F1062 Okay, my name is Muhammad Nabi bin Hazmi my metric number is 01 dt one nine seven one zero five eight. Right. So that was my team. Okay. So the first question is why we need to use SEO tools. Before that, what is SEO tools? SEO tools mean search engine optimization. So why we need to use search engine optimization in our business? Because this in the optimization is very important to uh, increase our business to get more popular, to get more trending, to get more customer. Because of SEO tools, our business will get more customer, will become trending in Google site. So because that, SEO tools is very, very, very important to uh, to business. Whatever business is worth, they all need to use SEO tools in their business. Example of SEO tools that are available. So many things that you can available um, for SEO tools like TechShop, like uh, Buffer, like Google Analytics, Browser, Browser, and many things. So we're gonna choose two, like Browser and Google Analytics. Why we choose this? Because it's simple and easy to use, and also suggestions to improve our marketing is this so this is a two example SEO tools that we choose so hi guys my name is Nabil and so I'm gonna teach how to use the Browseo so first you just search the bro co and then just click here okay so it will display like this first you need the first thing you need to know is that browseo.net here is a web app okay so which means you don't have to download because this is a web application not a download application so the first is enter a URL this one just enter a URL so this an URL that we would like to analyze they have already prefilled how the uh, prefill the form so we can see how they need to be format we can also copy the address of a page from another browser window and paste it in the here so now tap the browse button here just tap <coughs> okay it will display like this okay so here okay so <coughs> This is somewhat similar to what search engine see when they crawl it on the right the right hand. So this the right here you will find additional information about the current page such as details about redirect meta text, 
and headings a search engine results page and the link to share this page with co-workers our client they are pony their client will also find the link for downloading this data into spreadsheet format we will have a closer look at each of those in just a moment going back to the actual content of the page on the left hand side so you can highlight this one highlight links um, different link type the first link that you can highlight the meaning the internal the external and no follow for this highlight actually um, meaning links that point to page on the same domain Okay, so this is the first section okay okay here the first section shows the response code so this is actually respond the code okay uh, and in this particular case browseo.net shows us that the URL I have entered so they are, this is the URL I have entered is being redirected to another URL you can see so the next section here the next section here the next section is show us how many words are there on the page and how many links the word is 379 internal link is 74 external is 4 so they show us okay Again, the links are divided by internal links, meaning links pointing to page on. An external link, an external link, which are links pointing to page and other domains. And the last line uh, shows the number of links that carry the no follow attribute. And the head here, let's see the head here. So, the head section pulls information like the title lag, the meta descriptions, the meta descriptions, more and more depending on what Rosio.net finds in the search engine result. Page preview shows the how the page might be, and the sub preview. Here. This is a preview. Okay, so this is the the search engine result page preview shows you how the page might be. So this is how the page might be. Display um, in Google search results and for headings. This is the headings. The headings um section list all headline shows all headline sort by type and share on uh, this one share this page with others and if you want to share the search engine view of this page with clients or simply use this link now several power users have asked us so this uh, So that's a uh, brochure how it work and easy to use and free 100% free you guys can also use this brochure because it's very easy and it's a free web application SEO tools and it's basically um, this brochure um, Okay, this brochure brochure um, um, see how your website looks to search engine so that's it thank you all right so I'm gonna show you what is Google Analytics just type Google Analytics at Google and then okay so welcome to Google Analytics.
so as you can see you can read google analytics give you the free tools you need to analyze data for your business in one place so you can make smarter decision so you can uh, just tap at the setup for free and then you can just put your name about your detail so let's say my name is Shazwan so you can free alright and then just go to the next step and they gives, give you option what do you want to measure so that's me you can choose what do you want and after that you can just follow the step and you can use google analytics so that's about google analytics